So now I've got everything connected up. I've got my Deddy Prog connected to the breadboard, connected to a known good spy flash chip that I know I can read with the Deddy Prog. And I was able to confirm that the Deddy Prog can still read this, which means all my electrical connections are intact, which is a good thing to sanity check every now and then. So the next thing we need to do is we need to add in the Sele logic analyzer to see what's going on with this correct successful identification of the chip and then reading from the chip. So I've got my Sele set up in the same orientation as used elsewhere in the class. We've got pin, uh, we've got wire zero, connector zero here. So it goes zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, etc. So basically, I'm going to again skip the use of zero, and I'm going to have this pin one connected to, or sorry, connector one connected to pin one on the spy flash chip. Now there's two ways you can go about this. Either A, you can use the probes that come with the Sele, little micro grabber probes, and you can essentially slightly lift this thing up so that it's still plugged in, but it's just out enough that you can use the little grabber to go ahead and grab onto that. Now, this way is nice in the sense of it's quick and easy to connect up, but it's not necessarily going to yield the best electrical connections and kind of defeats the point of us having used this uh, breadboard in the first place. So if we want to be reliable about things, then instead we're going to have to use a dedicated wire. And so, for instance, we would connect this male-to-male -male wire here to this probe, and then we would connect it on the breadboard to this outside edge that I left open so that now it'll have a nice strong electrical connection. So you can choose to do it however you want to do. Uh, I'm going to use these electrical, these strong, you know, the, the more likely to be reliable electrical connections, but you can try the probes as well and see if that works for you. So now you should basically take all of these connections from the Sele to the breadboard and make all of those connections on your own so that everything is connected. We've got the Sele and the Deddy Prog connected to the breadboard, connected to the motherboard.